maybe get yourself a snack. Me and you gonna have a little chat about them. Hi guys, so it is day number two of the catch up readathon, but I am going to give you my day one update. It's just gone midday and I have done no reading today really because I've been very busy. I went out for a jog and then I was tidying up stuff and sorting out comments and editing videos and stuff so I haven't done any reading today except in the early hours of the morning which was reading carrying on from yesterday. But my update for yesterday's reading progress was pretty good. I actually managed to finish all of 1984 by George Orwell. There's 311 pages in this book and I managed to read it all in one day so I was pretty happy considering that I was fairly busy yesterday and I am going to be fairly busy most of the week as well. But yeah, I really enjoyed this. I 100% love this book. I did not expect to love it. I did not expect to enjoy it anywhere near as much as I did because the word classic always kind of puts me off books. However, I really enjoyed it and I think that it's just one of the best books that I've read in a very long time. So I will be doing a full review of this in the next few days and expect that maybe next week. So we'll see when I get time to edit it. But yeah, I really enjoyed this book and I gave it a 4.5 star rating, so it was really, really good. After I finished that, it was about just gone midnight in the morning, so I decided that I would make a start on Survivor by Chuck Palahniuk. I haven't got very far with this and it's already really creepy and weird. It's about a guy who basically, he wants people who are suicidal to ring him up so that he can pretend he is a god. He has a kind of god complex and he thinks that if suicidal people ring him up then the fact that he can tell them whether or not to kill themselves is really awesome to him. He's a bit of a psycho and it's really peculiar because he's hijacked a plane and I'm really confused. It's already completely and utterly crazy so I don't know where this is going and I really don't know what it's all about but it's very interesting in a weird and bizarre way so hopefully I will be able to finish this today. I found out that actually the page numbers are not really messed up they just go backwards so it starts at the end of the story and it works its way back to the beginning so there are actually 289 pages in this book and I am down to page 276 so I am not too far in but I am definitely intrigued by this and I really want to know where it's going because I don't have a clue. Also this morning I did listen to my Lord of Chaos audiobook for a little bit and I was really enjoying it but I didn't get very far. I probably read or listened to the equivalent of about five pages maybe because listening takes a lot longer so I did listen a tiny bit to that whilst I was getting ready for stuff but yeah I haven't read too much today so I will put the total number of pages read on the screen so you guys can see because I will work it out when I'm editing but yeah I'm really enjoying it so far I'm really happy that I decided to take part in this readathon and please let me know what you guys are doing if you have been reading then let me know what you're reading I would love to know whether or not you're taking part in the readathon and I will see you all very soon in my next video bye me and you gonna have a little chat about the